Okay, so today we're going to look at this Bosch oil filter, which looks to be made defective. A viewer who wants to remain anonymous, I'll just say he's from Washington State, sent me this filter. And this is a filter here that I opened up in a past video. You can see the louvers here. You can see that the louvers are opened up. See the light there. And let's check out this one here. Let me put the light back on. If you look inside this one, these louvers look to be closed. So to get a better look at it, I gotta open this filter up. And it'll be a lot easier to tell whether they they're closed or they're opened up like this one here. And this date code on here, I'll get that. 27729. And also I'll get this. This filter's made in Mexico. Origin, Mexico. So we'll open that one up. And this one here, date code. And I'll put the link to the video at the end where I opened up this one. And the date code on this, 27420. And this filter is made also in Mexico. Okay. So what I want to do is take this gasket off. It makes it easier to spin it on here. Oh, this filter is giving me a tough time getting open. There it goes. Okay, so what we really care about is the louvers. Okay. Let's see if we can see those. Still kind of hard to tell, but it looks like most of them look like they're closed. There's some that are open, but barely. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cut this. Let me cut this open, and I'll be right back and uh, look at these lures. Look extra glue there. Okay, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I cut the filter media all the way around. And I haven't even taken this off yet, so I'm going to do it right now. And we can all see it together. If these louvers are opened up or not. Let's find out. That's all falling apart. You know, I'm going to shut the light off here. Okay. Look at that. They're, they're hard to even open. You barely see them. There's some open there. Down below there, there's nothing open. See that down, down, if you look right down there, nothing, it's dark. And these are pretty dark too. Now if we compare it to this one, this is a good one, I marked it good. You can clearly see these are opened up. Yeah, you can see a lot of light coming through there. Compared to this one, and I, you know, I don't want to bash Bosch for this filter because this can happen to any brand. So I mean, uh, yeah, but that's see, that's that's a little good. I mean, it would probably let the oil go through, but who'd want to use a filter like this? I certainly wouldn't. And I want to thank the viewer who sent me this. Um, good catch too. You know, it's a good thing he didn't put this on his vehicle. You know, yeah. I, that's a very good catch. Look at that. You can tell these ain't even opened up. See that? 
So yeah, this is a garbage filter if you ask me. You know, a filter like this could it isn't going to filter much if it got clogged up and um, it'd be in bypass mode all the time. So like I said, I'm not bashing Bosch because any uh, any manufacturer could make filter a filter like this. What I do recommend though is everybody who buys filters like this do the same thing that like this viewer did. Look down the hole and see if the see if the louvers are open. Check the threads on these guys. Um, you know, check check the grooves here on the threads. Make sure there isn't any metal chips in there. Yeah, so I figured I'd just make a short little video. And I want to thank that viewer for sending me this oil filter so I could share this video with you guys. So again, another thanks to the viewer from Washington State. And I think I'll wrap this video up. And don't forget, Oil Filter Fridays. I try to open up an oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care. Yep, those louvers are pretty closed. I see this sucker in bypass mode most of the time.